Jeff was a little boy who moved to a new home. The day he moved in, he was invited to a neighbor's birthday party, so he decided to take his brother Lou along with him. When Jeff and his brother were waiting at a bus stop, three teenagers attacked them. Jeff successfully defeated his attackers and left them on the street with broken wrists and knife wounds. After this ordeal, Jeff soon realized that he actually enjoyed inflicting pain on others. It was always a feeling he had had inside him, but it only seemed to get stronger when he was provoked or angered on a night soon after that. Jeff's mother was awakened by someone crying in the bathroom. When she entered the room, she found Jeff carving a permanent smile into his cheeks. He had also managed to cut out his eyelids, so that he could never sleep. Seeing that her son had gone insane, his mother ran from the room to wake up her husband. She stopped cold when she saw Jeff standing in the doorway, a knife clutched in his hand. Mummy, you lied, was the last thing they ever heard. With his parents now dead, all that remained was his brother. Lou had woken up when he heard muffled sounds from his parents' bedroom. When he didn't hear anything else, he tried to go back to sleep, but couldn't shake the feeling that someone was watching him. Before he could do anything, a hand clamped down over his mouth and he felt a warm blade plunge into his stomach. Lou tried to escape his brother's grip, but it was already too late. Shh, Jeff said. Just go to sleep. Jeff was never seen again, but legend has it that Jeff is still out there, waiting.